Data is separated from the apps that, that you use. Um, and we wanted to make this a little bit more personal. So we consider your personal data as a digital expression of, your, of yourself. And the, the apps and services that you use, those are a digital expression of the, the brand or the company behind these, these apps. Um, and that brings us to our, our uh, vision or uh, vision statement. And that is that we want to enable people to take back their online autonomy by creating balanced relationships. Um, I underlined autonomy. And that basically means uh, that we want to give people back control over their data. And balance is that uh, if you connect with a brand, um, there are two entities that connect and they all should, they both should have a say in, in this uh, relation. Um, if we consider uh, a relation and not just a connection, there are several things we can uh, consider. First of all is when you enter a relationship, the other entity becomes part of your own identity. Um, the second thing is that a relationship goes through different uh, phases. You get to know each other or the brand. Um, you go, the relation gets deeper um, and sometimes it, uh, it will end as well. And the last thing about relations is that each relationship is uh, unique. Um, that's because of two things. Uh, one is that you and I can both look at the same brand or the same person, but, but see something different. But also uh, it's uh, when the context change, the, the way we um, interact in a relationship will also change. So with Loop, we try to use these, these different aspects of a relation and, and try to translate that into a product uh, that you yeah, that a user can use in, in uh, e-commerce. Um, and I would like to show you uh, some examples that, that we made and hopefully it uh, gives you an idea of like, what we wanted to do. So the first uh, concept is the, the feed. Basically the feed is that you can connect the brand to your own personal data account. Uh, so at this point, you don't have a relationship yet. You don't uh, have bought anything yet, but you can add um, the brand to your personal identity. Uh, if you do this, the, the brand doesn't know anything about you yet. You don't share um, data with, with the brand yet. Um, another thing is that if you shop with, with different brands, you can all collect them in, in your personal account. You can have an overview of all uh, the brands you connected with, the pur purchases you made. Um, and also you can go into the details of each brand uh, uh, and see how you are connected with them. Uh, you can adjust these connections or you can even remove the brand altogether. Um, and the last thing I want to show you is um, the express checkout. So with your data, in your own uh, account, you instead of filling out uh, a form, you can just have all your settings uh, ready uh, wherever you go and uh, just do the purchase. So this is almost done. You can make some quick adjustment adjustments and just quickly go to payment. Um, so these are just a few um, I think basic things uh, based on the, the customer journey in e-commerce as it is today, but we see uh, many new opportunities that, that we can do if we um, will approach uh, the way, yeah, if we, if we approach uh, it in, in this way. So hope it's a bit clear. Thank you for your uh, attention. And if there's any questions, please uh, 
let me know.